In this video, we're going to do substitution. Now, what that means is switching um, something for something else. So, in this case, it's going to be switching our letters for numbers. So, in this example, A is 5 and B is 2. So, wherever we see A, we're going to change it for 5. And wherever we see B, we're going to change it for 2. Um, whenever I substitute, I'm going to put brackets... So here I've got A, and I'm going to write this as with brackets around it. So A becomes 5, and B becomes 2. The reason I'm putting brackets is, isn't so much for now, but it's for when we use a calculator. Um, it makes sure there's no mistakes when the calculator does the working out. So if you always put brackets around your numbers when you substitute them, the calculator... Um, won't make a mistake. So 5 plus 2, that's 7. Here I've got 2a, so that's 2 fives, take away our 2. So 2a means 2 times a, so 2 times 5 is 10, take away 2, 10 take away 2 is 8. Here I've got a squared, 5 squared, plus b squared, which is 2. So 5 squared plus 2 squared. 5 times 5 is 25. 2 times 2 is 4. So that's 29. ab, that means a times b. So I've got 5 times 2. 5 times 2 is 10. 3ab, so 3 times a times b. So 3 times 5 times 2, 3 times 5 is 15, double 15 is 30. And here I've got a plus b squared, we do the bracket first. So I've got 5 plus 2, we do that first and then we square it. So 5 plus 2 is 7, so this is 7 squared, 7 times 7 is 49. Okay, with substitution, the biggest mistakes people make with negative numbers. So here in this example, I've got A is negative minus 5, negative 5, and B is negative 2 or minus 2. So when we're going to do this, we're going to remember the rules of multiplying negative numbers. So if I've got a positive times a positive, that's going to give me a positive answer. A positive multiplied by a negative gives me a negative answer. A negative multiplied by a positive is a negative answer, and a negative multiplied by a negative is a positive answer. Um, also, when we're adding up, if we've got plus plus next to each other, that means plus. Plus plus means plus. Plus minus or minus plus, they mean minus, and minus minus means plus. The rules of negative numbers confuse a lot of people, um, but make sure you remember these rules because they're going to help you answer the questions. So let's start substituting. So A becomes minus 5, B becomes minus 2. So we've got minus 5 plus minus 2. Plus minus just means minus, so it's minus 5 minus 2. Minus 5 down another 2, and that's minus 7. Here I've got two a's, 2 minus 5's, minus, minus 2. So 2 minus 5's, positive times a negative, positive times a negative is a negative. So 2 minus 5's are minus 10, and I've got minus, minus 2. Minus, minus means plus. So, minus 10 plus 2, minus 10 up to minus 8. A squared plus B squared. So, I've got minus 5 squared plus minus 2 squared. So, squared means multiplied by itself. So, I've got minus 5 times minus 5. So, negative times a negative is a positive. So, 5 5 to 25. Again, negative times a negative is a positive. So 
2 2 is a 4, 29. AB minus 5 multiplied by minus 2. A negative times a negative is a positive. 5 times 2 is 10. 3AB. Well, we know AB is 10, so 3AB is 3 times 10, which is 30. And A plus B squared, well, A plus B is minus 7, so this is minus 7 squared. And negative times a negative is a positive, 7 times 7, 49. Okay, pause the video and see if you can have a go at these questions, and I'll go through the answers afterwards. Okay, so in this case we're substituting um, a for 2 and b for negative 3, minus 3. So 2 a's, 2 2's, plus minus 3. That's 4, plus minus means minus, so 4 minus 3, 1. A minus B, so I've got 2 minus minus 3, 2 minus, minus minus means plus, so 2 plus 3, 5. 2 A squared, so it's 2 times 2 squared, 2 squared is 4, times 2 is 8. A, B. A times B, 2 times minus 3, positive times a negative is a negative, 2, 3 is a 6. A, B squared. So it's A times B first, and then we're going to square it. So A times B, then square. So 2 times minus 3, we've just, we've just done, that was minus 6, minus 6 squared, 6 6 is 36. And a plus b squared, so that's a plus b, and then squared after. 2 plus minus 3 means 2 minus 3, that's minus 1, minus 1 squared, so minus 1 times minus 1, minus times a minus makes a plus, 1 1 is 1.